Uh, welcome to the Conservation Commission meeting being held 12-4-23 uh, in the City Council hearing room. Uh, you can watch the uh, meeting through uh, Fred TV. Uh, pursuant to the open meeting law, any person may make an audio or video recording of this public meeting or may transmit the meeting through any medium. Attendees are therefore advised that such recordings or transmissions are being made, whether perce perceived or unperceived, by those present and deemed acknowledged and permissible. Uh, we'll start with roll call. To my left, Chris Boyle here. Louis Ferrer. John Brandt. Jim Kizik. Paul Amaral. Nikita Diara. James Owen Hornsby. And we also have uh, Dan Aguiar, uh, Conservation Commission, and uh, Nina Pavo, uh, Head Clerk. And we have Craig from uh, FRTV. Um, first on the business is a request for a certificate of compliance, SE-24-761. Owner applicant is Department of Conservation and Recreation. Project location is Cope Cut Road. Assessor's map is W-19-0010, filed by the Department of Conservation and Recreation, requesting a certificate of compliance, stating that work regulated by the above reference order of condition has been satisfactorily completed. This was tabled from our November 6th meeting. Uh, we haven't heard anything back, but Chris, could you update us on this a little bit? You've been... Yes, so... Um... I recently sent to Nina three, three contact, regional level contacts. So the state's divided into several regions with South region. So I recently provided her the contact information for the South regional supervisor, the district manager, and the region, and the, um, what they call a photo. Um, it's uh, my understanding they were aware that the project took place, but I'm not sure with what level of specificity they understand the project. So. Um, she, Nina's going to reach out to them, and we'll see if we can get them here for the January meeting. Okay. Does anyone have any questions? Can I have a motion to table to the January meeting? Okay. So moved. Second. Roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Yes. Okay. Measure passes. Uh, next is a notice of intent, SE-24831. Owner applicant is Jeff Sylvia. Project location is 2450 Indian Town Road. Assessor's map W-34-0012, filed by Ecosystem Solutions, Inc., on behalf of applicant. The applicant is proposing restoration plan to remove the unauthorized cart path created in or around 2017 from an order conditions from 1997. DP file number is SE-24-289, tabled from November. So as an update, um, you remember the discussion we had at the last hearing with mm -hmm. the... Um, with the applicant and their representative we have a number of items that we needed to address the first one was they they did give us the new filing fee for the wetlands line that was an issue they did get a file number they are still actually after the meeting we finally got a letter from natural heritage um, which i don't think was as positive as the applicant was hoping for mm -hmm. so they are working directly um, with natural heritage and endangered species program uh, to figure out if there's any further action needed on on their behalf so until that happens um, there's really nothing for us to do. Okay. So can I have a motion to table till Jan uh, February? I mean, January. January. Motion to table. Second. Roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Okay. Next is a discussion of Bell Rock Road. Review and discussion of LSP document review opinions for Bell Rock Road tabled from the November 6th meeting. I don't know if anybody wants to come up and present, but what I would offer is that um, we did finally get some um, updated testing at the direction of our LSP. Those test results were sent to us this morning. I have not reviewed them, and I have not had a chance to uh, discuss it with our consultant as well. So um, if nobody wants to make a formal presentation, I would just recommend that we table it until our consultants had a chance to review it and make, make some recommendations. <coughs> okay. Would you like to type in? I'm um, sure. Uh, good evening, John Zajac uh, for First Blue Street Limited regarding Bell Rock Road. Um, that is true. We we did get the reports over just uh, just I think earlier this morning. Yep. Um, we only received them ourselves I think on Friday or over the weekend. So uh, if uh, excuse me, sir, could you yes. speak into the microphone? Of course. Sorry about that. Thank you. Uh, so certainly, if it's the position of the of the uh, commission that they need more time to review it, I certainly understand that. <clears throat> okay. 
Yeah, I mean, I, re I reviewed it briefly this afternoon, and there is a lot of information in there. Um, there is. It's about 80 pages long. I understand from, right. from our provider that it's, it's all positive information. It's generally good, but I understand you need some time to digest it. So. Yeah, from what I could review, there was nothing that, no, just quickly, major issues, but I, but I think we do need time to go through that report. Okay. So can I have a motion to table this till January 6th after we review it? Motion to table. Seconded. Roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Yeah. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, next is a request for certificate of compliance, SE-24-775, owner applicant is AIS Real Estate Development Corp, project location 242 Courtney Street, assessor's map U-05-0073, filed by applicant who is requesting a certificate of compliance. The applicant states that the work regulated in above referenced order of conditions has been satisfactorily completed. I was able to make a site walk, and I would offer that they have substantially complied with the order. The site is stable. The site is complete. Um, I would recommend the issuance of a certificate of compliance. Okay. Can I have a motion to order a certificate of compliance? Motion to approve the CSA. Second. Roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Okay. Next on the list is a request for certificate of compliance, SE-24-793, owner applicant. Highland Farms Development 2 LLC, project location 8 Stony Brook Circle, assessor's map is U-04-0071, filed by Civil Environmental Consultant Inc. on behalf of the applicant. The applicant is requesting a certificate of compliance with the exception of final lawn development on the, this lot. The work authorized under this order has been completed in substantial compliance with the order conditions. The only thing I would offer is that I, I think what the applicant did on their, these next three submissions they just did a cut and paste where it says, with the exception of final lawn development, all three of these do have final lawn development done. So okay. they're 100% complete. Okay. okay. And I would recommend the issuance of a certificate of compliance. Okay. Can we take them all? Yep. That's up to together. you. All right. Make a motion. Make a motion. We I'll take, second that. Take all three. Uh, I, uh, under new business, items two, three, four. Okay. Together. All righty. Second. So we're going to take. Uh, Highland Farms 2's uh, project location 78 Fieldstone Lane and project location 41 Fieldstone Lane. Can I have a motion to uh, issue an order certificate of compliance? I think Chris already did that, so I'll so, okay. so moved. Second. Okay. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Okay. Next is a notice of intent. Hold, SC Hold on. Wait one second. He made a motion to take them together. Now I need to make, make a motion to issue. Two. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, motion so made. You're so shocked. Second. Roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Thank you. <laughs> All righty. Uh, notice of intent SE 24 832. Owner applicant Howell Street Properties, LLC. Uh, Perils <coughs> Products Solar Energy. Project location 109 Howe Street, assessor's map is B-20-0001, filed by Farland Corp. On behalf of the applicant, this applicant is proposing the development of 40 residential units, uh, necessary cuts, fills, roadways, stormwater, basins, and utility infrastructure in the buffer zone, but the applicant didn't uh, properly file the advertising, so can we have a motion to table this till January? Motion to table. Second. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Okay. Next is a request for extension uh, permit for order of conditions SE-24-740. Owner applicant is Aaron Wachowski and National Grid Project Location 181 Bell Road, Bell Rock Road. This is map existing substation ROA easement uh, seasement uh, filed by National Grid requesting an extension permit. For order conditions SE-24740, all proposed upgrades of the station facilities have been completed for the order of conditions. However, the wetland restoration plans are submitted include a monitoring of the restoration area for two growing seasons following its construction. The applicant is requesting a extended uh, order of conditions to December 31st, 2024. 
Carmen Dancy um, on behalf of National Grid. Uh, I'm just presenting on it. Mm -hmm. So we completed the wetland restoration in uh, September of 2022, monitored for the last growing season. Um, it is in compliance with the uh, state's performance standards for bordering vegetated wetlands, um, but per the plans that we submitted to your commission um, in the original NOI, uh, we did state that we would monitor it for two full growing seasons until okay. it reached that. So we are looking to extend the order of conditions to make sure we do proper monitoring. Sounds good. Does the board have any questions? Um, is there any other work going on or 100% everything's completed so we're just dealing with this? Okay. Yep, this is the only item. Um, in the NOI, we did say that we would monitor at minimum once a month during the growing season yeah. of the replication area. So this is the last item to do. Okay. okay, thank you. Okay, so can I have a motion to issue an extension? So moved. Seconded. Uh, roll call. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, next on the list is a review and discussion on adopting fee structures. Uh, we did pass the, uh, voted on the amounts at our last meeting we had for this. Mm -hmm. So I guess we need to vote on it. Do we want to send it to the city council? Well, I, I don't think we've figured out yet, or maybe okay. at least yeah. I haven't, um, whether the commission has the ability to create a fee schedule without a bylaw. Um, so you can you can vote to now, send it. Wouldn't the we follow the state's bylaw? Wouldn't that be our bylaw? Right, but the state has fees, mm -hmm. and we get fees in association with those fees okay. with the formula. So I think fees in excess of what the state's bylaw what this wetlands protection act allows i think has to be done through our own municipal bylaw okay. i don't know the answer to that so you can vote that if if it's determined that we can send it to the council we can um i just don't know if, if we can so we'd have to check with what mac on that i guess you know this it will send out some kind of correspondence and try to follow up with i i know any municipality that i had ever done work in um if they had a separate fee schedule, they also had a bylaw, mm. um, okay. and they're usually made part of that bylaw. So I'm not, I'm not sure. All right. Well, how about we make a motion to table this till January till we figure out if we need a bylaw? Who would well, make that determination? Well, could we have a little the more law? discussion? <laughs> the law? No. Who would, who would, who would write the bylaw? Who would approve it? Who would well, I mean, you guys had had some discussion about mm -hmm. creating bylaws right. and what so. Correct. You, you can you can propose a bylaw. So this would be our first bylaw. Should well, we no, send this it? This isn't a bylaw. Right. No. This so is my just point a is schedule. My, so what I'm asking, I think, Dan, is should we, one, find out, find out first, if yeah. we need a bylaw, yep. separate bylaw, yes. and two, then develop the bylaw in a, so we can send the entire package to the, to the city well, council? Well, if, if, if the state law allows you to create a fee schedule without a bylaw, then we're all set. Then, then we can go ahead with okay. this. Um, so let's, why don't we find that out first? Okay. Uh, <laughs> and then if not, I think yeah, we, we need to start do a bylaw. cleaning up and figuring out where are we at sure. bylaw wise and do we have a final document okay. Um, okay. to move forward on. Right. Jim, did you have a question? No, I, it seems to me that between the, the state guidelines and their guidelines for the state, and they're not bylaws that are in effect for us, their the suggestions for us to, to adopt. Between that, uh, I'd like to see us just go with, just adopt the bylaw, adopt bylaws and the fee schedule, fung, and get it done and get it over to the city council. Well, we'll, we'll check first to make sure that we can. Um, what do you mean? Of course we can. What? I mean, what do you mean by can? You mean like the, City Council won't take it or? Yeah, I mean, we don't know if we need to have bylaws to have the fee structures. We'll check on that tomorrow. We'll send a correspondence. Right, okay, but what I'm. Tonight, tonight, the only thing before you is a fee schedule. No, but I'm not, I know that. So I don't know if we can move, move forward. No, I'm not suggesting we do it tonight. That was, not, I did not make a motion. But it seems to me that to do a bylaw, to do a fee section, 
one of the things that will get our bylaws through is when having served on an elected board is the fact that we're going to raise some money for the city and we should pass the whole thing in and the things that are co the other things are perhaps a little more controversial uh, we couldn't fully agree on the on the uh, but we came very very close to agreeing on the rest of the the substance of the bylaws and i think what we should do is is uh, either at a special meeting or next month depending on the i mean we We've been going all of 20 minutes tonight. I'm not suggesting we go further, but there seems to be less business in the winter. Yeah. Well, uh, let us check with the uh, state, and then we'll we'll know where we're going. Next. Well, I would like to so hope we could put bylaw bylaw and fee adoption, possible bylaw fee adoption, on the agenda yeah, for the next January. month. Yeah, we can do that. So for that January. we could move on it. Yeah. I mean, we've gone this long without uh, fee structures. Well, another month isn't going to... No, right. Destroy, I'm not so. arguing for do it tonight. That's yeah. not my point. My point is to, is to think about it. Yeah. No, Possibly. And you, would work, um, you were working with the state guidelines, so you now have more information yeah. than uh, perhaps the rest of us. Yeah. Uh, maybe you can share that and get well, a draft we'll, out we'll, we'll, and we'll, do we'll, it. We'll check with the state to see if we need it. And if we do need it, well, then we'll have to do the bylaws, and then we can do the fee structure. Well, I think we should do it. If, uh, I'm not arguing that we need it for the state. I'm arguing that we need it for our city, yeah. and we need it to get the. We need it to show the city council that we have a complete package here, and we're moving forward, which we are. Mm -hmm. And we need to. That needs to be recognized, okay. and uh, in a set of bylaws, including. A fee section. Okay, point point taken. Uh, so can I have a motion to table this till January? Motion. So moved. Second. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. Aye. Can I have a motion to approve of the minutes from November sixth? Motion to approve minutes. Second. So. Aye. 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 Yes. Aye. I see All no right. citizen input. Can I have a motion to adjourn? Uh, before we adjourn, it's okay. You, I don't need to make a motion to put that stuff on the agenda, do I? We're, we're sending notification tomorrow. Fine. Mm -hmm. we'll, we adjourn. Okay. Roll call. Aye. Can we have a second? Second. Yes. Oh, second. 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 Okay. Aye. First, second. Yeah. Aye. Aye. Yes. Aye. 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 All righty. Excellent. Have a good Christmas. Thank you. Everybody Thank have you. a good Thank Christmas. You.